how my ex described my relationships. <laughs> um, that's a tough one. So we met at Alistair and we worked together there as models. A mutual friend's birthday party. On Tinder. And she was attracted to my smile, definitely. I was attracted to her eyes, hair, body. <laughs> Who made the first move? He did. He messaged me first on Tinder. He definitely made the first move. He made the first move. So our first kiss was at a party in college. At a bar on our second date. In my backyard. We were playing Uno. I beat him seven times. <laughs> and our first official date was at an Ohio themed bar in New York, and we we're both from Ohio. A night out clubbing. We ended up playing Uno. I really liked her sense of humor, calm demeanor, charm. <laughs> the best part of my personality is sense of humor, determination, the super bright, stunning, charming guy. Our go to restaurant was Pianos, which is kind of like a bar. Tresse in Union Square. <laughs> the bodega. Who usually paid for dates? Tony always paid. He did. He usually paid on dates. We saw the movie. In our cellar together. Paid in full. We didn't really go out to movies. The best picture of us was... And we loved... To party. Go dance. Play Uno. We said I love you. Once. And it was weird. <laughs> we broke up shortly after, so... <laughs> We, we never, never said did. I love you. In the morning, I used to make her bacon, egg, and cheese from the bodega. <laughs> bacon, egg, and cheese from the bodega. He never made me breakfast, and he never even got me breakfast. I used to call her Lambo, Shoddy. Angel Face, and she called me Jet, Tony. No nickname. Our sex life was very interesting, spicy, amazing. <laughs> he was creative. <laughs> then we lived together. We lived together for about a year. We, we never lived together. together. Who was funnier? He was the funny one. He's definitely the funniest one in the relationship. <laughs> me. She knew my favorite food was pizza, french fries, cheeseburgers, grilled cheese sandwich. She thought my friends were obnoxious and douchey. Never really met his friends, actually. He doesn't have many, but the ones he has are nice. And when we hang out with my friends, I'm really fun. The center of attention. The bigger personality. She hated my hard headedness, attitude, inconsistent texting. And I hated her nasty attitude, my insensitivity. Avoided talking about her problems. She hated when I left hair everywhere after shaving. Wore his sunglasses day and night. He eats an astronomical amount of fast food. I hate when she appeared to be flirting. When I would get all germaphobic. Nothing. We always fought about not communicating enough. Photos we posted online. Our living situation. Were we in love? Yeah, we were in love. Mm, no. We were definitely not in love. <laughs> we dated for a year, eight, eight months. months. We broke up because... He was angry at me for not coming with him to meet his family at Thanksgiving. Distance and our schedules didn't align. He was a player. I think she told my future girlfriend... Don't get too attached because he's never in one place for too long. Girl, your man is her man too. You just gotta peel the onion back. He's really sweet and just appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, I'm on good terms with my ex-girlfriends. Me and Tony are definitely on good terms still. We're really good friends. Yeah, we're still friends. We're still on good terms. I don't know what I'm looking for in my next girlfriend until I find her.